today's video, um, I'm going to be telling you what a dividend is and how it works. I personally think it would be a great video to be telling you guys because I'm just trying to figure out videos that people haven't really made yet. And I couldn't find this video, so before we get into it, please like it and subscribe. And that's all I ask. It's totally free. It would mean a lot. Um, it's going to be a very short video. I just want you to know. That. So a dividend stock is something that pays you, say, quarterly. For example, Apple stock pays you a 0.66% dividend, which means for every $100 you invested, you get paid $0.66. Cents. But even though it's a small dividend, you're still getting passive income. And also, Apple, if you say don't know what it is, I'm assuming you do, um, it's very popular. They make MacBooks, iPads, iPhones, iPods. They make lots of stuff. I probably didn't even say all of them, but they the stock the stock itself does very good and it performs good. So, if you don't know what a dividend is, still I'm sorry, but to put this all in perspective, it's something that pays you when you own it as a stock, a tiny piece of what you actually own. So, if you got this far, thanks for watching. Um, in my link below, there's a Robinhood link. If you sign up on Robinhood and deposit money, you can get a free stock, and we both will. Um, it's valued up to like $250, so time to get rich. Also, to open up a Robinhood account, you gotta be over the age of 18. Um, but on TD Ameritrade, you don't have to be. You can open one both of your, you and your parents' name. So when you turn 18, you can transfer it over. I have a video on that if you want to go watch it on how to open one. If you want to start investing, I'd recommend single stocks. So, or not single stocks. I'm so sorry. Not single stocks. Don't invest in single stocks if you are emotional with your money because I do not want you to be losing your money. Invest in something like an index fund like VTI or VOO. Those are two I'd recommend. Um... The index funds average 8 to 11 percent historically. So those are better than a single stock that has lots of volatility. <laughs> volatility. Okay. And before I go, also go follow me on Instagram. Okay. Have a good day. Peace.